Thank you very much. Hi, my name's Harry Bentivania Lichtenstein. What are we protesting? Well, first of all, we're protesting uh, psychiatric abuse. We're protesting, and this is just an introduction. We are, we are protesting uh, not only medications and things that aren't cures. Well, of course they're not cures. How can you have cures for make-believe diseases? And I'm going to back this up. I'm making some statements that if someone across the street hears right now, they're going to think outrageous. When I'm done, they're going to, if they're listening, wonder why wasn't I given this information in school? Anyway, so yes, there's no cures because you have no disease to cure. People need coaching sometimes. They need uh, consultation in how to reach their goals. They don't, that's not a disease. But we're also protesting electroshock. How in the world can you put high voltage so it causes trauma in people's heads and get them to uh, get any benefit? Even from a make-believe disease. Ridiculous. The labels I talked about, the drugs, the toxic drugs they use that they call medicines for make-believe disease are nothing but toxic poisons. The corporate profit, profit at the expense of lives is disgusting. The drugging of our children is disgusting. In the war against children of color by Peter Bragan, there's a section there that talks about uh, the, uh, about children. The contents of this book are government's master plan, backers of the violence initiative, born to be violent, born to be disruptive, current federal programs, uh, biomedical, uh, ending biomedical child abuse. This is Linda Andre's Doctors of Deception. And in this book, she talks about the history of what, how this came about. Animals in human form, the idea that mental patients were useless eaters who ought to be killed for the good of all had been popularized by German psychiatrist Alfred Hotch and Carl Binding in their 1920 book, Permission for the Destruction of Lives Unworthy of Life. And I have tons of evidence like that, tons of things that back up what I'm saying, and, and I wanted to just say that there, that that uh, Reagan went into how they went into killing children in Nazi Germany before they killed adults as mental patients, so-called mental patients with mental diseases, and Reagan puts that in his book War Against Children. Uh, so. In summary, uh, the war against uh, children, biopsychiatry, there's a whole section, by the way, on diseases and biopsychiatry. The evidence is in War Against Children, page 53. And finally, I'll, summar I'll just finish with this. So, there's a lot, there, there is no basis for what they are doing. It is only corporate greed, and, uh, and evilness that make them think that if they make money, trillions of dollars in the pharmaceutical industry, maybe billions of dollars in the electro shock industry with the machines that do it, etc., they think that justifies it. No! Oh, profit no, no, that is no, unethical no, is no, not right! No, no, no! Okay! No! Thank you! All right, I hope you enjoyed the speech!